Hey, it's Joshua Vergara from Android Authority. What's going on, everybody? And here we are with the LG Stylus here at MWC 2016. This is the larger of the mid-range devices, and it actually kind of looks like a throwback to the LG G Pro series, and it also has a couple of elements that are different from the current new lineup of smartphones. Uh, the LG G5, of course, did away with the back button layout, and you have it here in the LG Stylus, which, in my opinion, is kind of nice to have because, personally, I really like the rear-facing buttons. We'll go ahead and get the specs out of the way. The stylus has a 1.2 gigahertz quad core processor with 1.5 gigabytes of RAM. You do get a micro SD card slot to bolster the 16 gigabytes of onboard storage and the 5.7 inch 720p display provides uh, pretty decent colors and output. A 13 megapixel rear camera with an eight megapixel front camera as far as all the imaging and a 3000 milliamp hour battery uh, sounds about right for a 5.7 inch display. All things considered, this is actually a phone that feels kind of nice in the hand. You have a textured backing and the 5.7 inch display does make it feel a little bit meatier in the hand. However, with this larger display, uh, we do think it's a bit of a bummer that it only comes in at 720p resolution. But of course, the main crux of this experience is the stylus itself. Now, LG doesn't always put out a stylus type experience on its smartphones. And with the LG stylus, you get it right here. A nice feature coming into this is one you may have seen before on Samsung devices, but LG's own version of what can be considered a pen command menu is the pen pop, a mode that toggles a special shortcut menu when the stylus is removed. And you get a look at a number of different functions, including ones that can be user defined, and it all pops in from the side and it looks quite nice. But there's also the pen keeper, which notifies you when you're walking away from your stylus. Uh, that way it will detect that the phone is in motion without the pen installed. Now, of course, this LG stylus is going to be a somewhat jump forward from last year's G4 stylus, but an improved stylus experience and a better out-of-the-box software that uses Android 6.0 Marshmallow. Yes, without the app drawer, as this is another one of those phones from LG that does not include the app drawer, uh, will be able to provide enough to win the hearts of LG fans who want a more affordable phone with a stylus experience. Keep it tuned to Android Authority for even more from LG as we take a look at the lineup of their phones after the dust has settled from their LG G5 announcement. Keep it tuned here for even more because we are your source for all things MWC 2016.